What is up guys? So today I'm going to be doing an animation battle between One UI 6.1.1 and One UI 6.1. So the Galaxy Z Flip 6 will have One UI 6.1.1 and the Galaxy S24 Plus will have One UI 6.1. So let's get started. So the first animations I'm going to go through are just the, you know, ones on the home screen. So honestly, both One UI 6.1 and One UI 6.1.1 are relatively similar when it comes to the animation department. They definitely have some improvements, but yeah, overall I would say they're generally kind of similar, just One UI 6.1.1 has some updates or like, you know, upgrades to like smoothness and stuff like that. So let me know what your thoughts are of which one is better down in the comments after, you know, everything goes through the, the cycle. Here, when ChatGPT opened and wouldn't open on the Galaxy Z Flip 6, that's because the internet um, was first off really slow and the fact that the S24 Plus didn't have internet on, um, so that's why it didn't, you know, go and do that. So one thing is that the Google Play Store has a new search icon, which as you can see is right there at the bottom instead of at the top, so that's definitely different. And now, yeah, I'm just kind of going through, um, like opening an app from a widget. So, I mean, honestly, I think the animations are pretty solid. And I do want to say right now, like as of the recording of this video, which it's like August 2nd, yes, yeah, August 2nd, um, the Galaxy Z Flip 6 and the Galaxy Z Fold 6 are the only devices that currently are running One UI 6.1.1. So you're not going to get this on every Samsung device as of yet. Hopefully at, um, in like mid-August, you'll be able to get it though. So here I'm just going around with the recent tab. Um, I think that obviously, well, okay, so this is a good luck application that makes it um, stacked like iPhone. Um, but yeah, so the, but the default, um, you know, uh, most like recent, whatever um, tab is as like smooth as it is right here. If anything, maybe it's a little bit smoother, but I just like how, you know, iPhones is. So that's how I have it set up. And now I'm going on the quick setting area, going back and forth between the two devices to see which one is, you know, smoother. And honestly, they both do a really great job. I would say the Galaxy Z Flip 6 was a little bit more responsive. When you see only half of it, like only the notifications popping down, that's just because um, I only like, you know, swiped from halfway or not from the um, top right corner. So this is the um, place that an app that has been improved to the Galaxy Z Flip 6 and it'll come to the Z, Fol or Z Flip 5 too. Um, that's the new interpreter, so I don't think it shows on the screen. No, it doesn't. Okay, so only on that screen, but it'll show the interpretation on the cover screen, so that is pretty cool. So now we're just, you know, going through the different camera application or the, the camera app, you know, animations. So just to see how that's improved. Honestly, not too much has changed with that. Pretty much the same. Um, but yeah, let me know if you spot like any differences. So here I'm just, you know, doing the cutout thing and then I'm going to add it into a note on both of these devices. 
So just create a new note and then just drop it wherever. I did notice that the Galaxy S24 Plus did load it faster, but yeah. So let me know what you think down in the comments, which operating system you prefer better and which one you think has the smoother operations or <laughs> operations animations. Uh, yeah, so let me know down in the comments and thank you so much for watching. And if you want more content on the Galaxy Z Flip 6, definitely subscribe for that. And yeah, thanks for watching. I'll catch you in my next video and I'll see you then.